Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, so today I have an ASOS haul for you guys. ASOS hasn't really been somewhere that I've been shopping. Um, this is like the first proper order that I've done from there in quite a while. Um, I just happened to go on at the weekend. They had 20% off, which was great. And I found some really, really lovely pieces, kind of more casual everyday wear. And then a couple of pieces that I got for holiday as well. Fingers crossed I can still go one week left please do not cancel my flights again <laughs> um so yeah i'm gonna crack on with the pieces i've not tried any of this on yet but i'll obviously try it on for you in the cutaways after i film this bit okay so first item we have a super wide leg pair of jean jeans now these ones are from stradivarius probably butchering it like i always do um but why i got these is because one they're a really really soft denim which is amazing um and two is because my other wide leg jeans have rips and i kind of wanted a pair that didn't have rips um i got this these in a uk eight the do look kind of big so i'm hoping they fit okay um if not i'll try and have to get a six but i'm pretty sure the six was gone um but yeah as you can see they're a super super wide leg and they just got kind of like a contrast denim bit on the bottom there it is also like a distressed a distressed hem on the bottom which is great because i find that that sits so much nicer on trainers um super super high-waisted which is fabulous um and yeah just really really great they've obviously just got the two pockets in the back there and that is the front of them um love the color of these it's like a really really like light pale blue um so yeah i'm just hoping they fit nicely and they're not going to be too big but yeah i'll obviously show you guys in the cutaways um these type of jeans i love to wear with just like a tank top with a blazer over the top um yeah that's kind of like my go-to look at the moment so yeah love them talking about tank tops i have picked up quite a few different ones in this haul first up we have this one from asos design and i just loved the shape of this i don't know if you can see so it's got like a really long like arm bit where it kind of like comes out and then it's just got like a longer elongated v at the front kind of makes it look like it's like ripped or something like that this one is in a gorgeous like nude color i don't know if you can see and yeah it's just in this rib really really stretchy um and the back's the same at the top but it's a little bit shorter if you can see that there so yeah this would look great with the jeans that i've just showed you little blazer on top and then also just on its own i'd wear this with like denim shorts and things like that as we finally have nicer weather in the uk which is great so yeah i got this one in an eight again it seems quite big so i don't know if i could have got a six um i'm hoping it will be okay but yeah absolutely love that and then another tank top i got this lime green little number i absolutely loved the color of this um this one is from bershka i got a medium um and the medium looks okay i'm pretty sure i couldn't get another size but what i loved about this one is that it's got like kind of like no armhole it's just got the bottom bit here so it's really really open again i thought this would look great with the wide leg jeans also with shorts and i just loved the pop of color um, i'm not too sure if it will suit me i think it should um but yeah loved the color and i'm hoping the medium will be okay price wise i think this was around like the 14 pound mark i'm not too sure but i'll obviously leave the links down below this is like a really soft knit and really really stretchy as well so you can probably get away with sizing down in these to be fair because they do stretch quite a lot and then it's just got kind of like a crew neckline there as well i did also get this in a white because i really really loved it but they only have it a large and the large is considerably a lot bigger than the medium so i'm not sure if this one's gonna fit i did kind of hope that sometimes i can get away with like ordering different sizes in these style tops because there's usually not much in them uh, it's just a lot longer as you can see yeah the large is just a lot longer in the white but i'll give it a go might be all right um so yeah exactly the same as the lime green i just love that kind of detailing on the armhole really really good quality um so yeah i got this one in a large but we will see if this fits me nicely okay so i also got some denim shorts um i have quite a lot of pairs of denim shorts in like a blue or i don't even know a black i own a lot of like just blue denim shorts so i wanted another color now i saw these ones these ones are from the brand weekday i believe yeah weekday i got these ones in a size 27 so i'm usually a 26 in denim shorts but i kind of wanted these to be a little bit more baggier and then i can always cinch the waist in with a belt if need be um so they're in a gorgeous like ecru 
color as you can see and they're just kind of like a mum short i would say um they've got a distressed bottom which i really like so i might distress that even more you know and just pull them out like so just so just gives a little bit more of a rugged look um i love weekday jeans um so yeah i'm really excited to try these and i hope they fit well i like from first glance i love the shape of them you can see that they're skinnier on the waist which is great um just the double they've got pockets on the back there and they also do on the front and it's got a silver hardware as well which i also like because a lot of places with ecru or white they always put rose gold and i'm not a fan um so yeah i'm excited to try those the model with those shorts had on a shirt or was it the shirt that i found first one way or another so i saw this shirt and this one is actually from mango i got it in an extra small and i just loved the colors of it so it's kind of like a it's not like satin what is it what is this material it's like cheese clothy. is that the right word probably just gonna say like polyester or something yeah 100 percent polyester it's like um kind of like a cheesecloth material i'm gonna go with which is kind of good for like on holiday because i didn't want it to be like satin because i'm not really a fan of wearing like satin on holiday literally just sweat buckets but anyway i loved the color of the stripe so it's like a nudie white and white stripe so i got this to wear like tucked in with those denim shorts that's what the model had them on with and it looks so so nice i got this one in an extra small it does seem quite like oversized already so i'm glad i did um so yeah i'll probably wear this maybe either with like over the top of a bikini on holiday tucked into those shorts even tucked into like a pair of like nice white trousers i think this would look gorgeous price wise i don't think it's gonna say is it no i want to say maybe around the 40 pound mark for a mango shirt um it's just got the also the open vent at the back there and it's got these really really nice like pearl buttons if you can see so yeah i'm really really happy with that um creams whites all that type of vibe for holiday um i think they will look really really nice okay so a little bit of an out there purchase for me but this is kind of to wear with a bikini on holiday um i've got a like terry toweling bikini from triangle um that i'm gonna wear on holiday and then i saw this bucket hat and i was like mm, that could be quite nice to go with for a photo so this one is from and i've seen so many people wear them and they look so cool and such a vibe of like a bikini and a bucket hat on holiday am i gonna pull it off potentially not but i thought i'd give it a go um so yeah i got this one this one is from collusion so it's in like a cream toweling i don't know if you can see that yet and i kind of liked it because the like collusion wasn't so obvious should i do a try on test i've never actually i'm just saying this now i've never actually put a bucket hat on my head before so i have no idea what they're gonna look like oh no i don't think it's the one is it does this suit me i don't know if it's too wide it's quite big it was only one size like can you picture me with this hat on bikini or do i just need to give it up now <laughs> i can't see i'm trying to see in the mirror over there i don't know if my hair is too long for it like i don't know sometimes it'd be better if i just had like short hair that finished like here with a bucket hat <laughs> i really don't know guys just let me know down below this one is quite big it was like one size so i don't know whether i need one that you can get like a small medium or large and i can get a small because it's quite big but yeah let me know what you think it really wasn't very expensive at all i just hadn't seen one that was like a toweling material so yeah i thought it would be good for holiday i mean i'll try it on with my bikini but it potentially might be going straight back <laughs> but let me know down in the comments below if you think i should keep or return okay another holiday item i picked up this um like kind of linen skirt i don't know what i was going to try and say then um it's from a four phone reckless i love four phone reckless i've worked with them before um absolutely love all of their stuff they always smash it and the quality is amazing um so i picked up this linen kind of like it looks like it's supposed to be a wrap do you know what i mean but it's like a fake wrap like ruffle skirt at the top and then it kind of like goes down into a wrap and then opens 
Um, so yeah, I thought this would be really nice to pair with a bikini and sandals on holiday, um, just to chuck on. Again, I don't think it was too expensive at all. Um, that's the colour, so it is like your standard like linen colour. I shall tell you this percentage. So it is 88% viscose and a 12% linen, so it is a really, really soft linen mix. Um, the only reservation I have on this is it looks quite wide. So I don't know if it's going to suit me as much as if it was a bit more fitted. But yeah, we'll give it a go. This with like a white bikini, fedora hat and sandals was like my type of vibe just to go to like the beach and stuff. You could also like dress this up in the evening with like a nice more of a smarter top and heels. So yeah, it's a really versatile skirt. Um, so yeah, I think if it looks nice on me, then I will get quite a lot of wear out of it. I did get this one in the UK 6 and I'm glad I did because it does look kind of big i do find in their stuff that i do have to size down um yeah just because they are a little bit more on the oversized side now the final item not very summery at all but i kind of had like an outfit in mind um i picked up these um wide leg joggers from at bershkin i got these in a small so i'm kind of, and they did have an extra small so i'm kind of well i'm hoping they're not too big they don't look that big on the waist actually so yeah, we will see. So yeah, I've got these wide leg joggers. They have like the drawstring top with like a really wide waistband, which I absolutely love. They're in this gorgeous like creamy color. They've got pockets on the side there. They've got the trim detailing all the way down and they just go into a wide leg jogger. Um, again, price wise, I'm not too sure. Probably around the 20 pound mark. But I got these because I kind of wanted to wear similar similar way to how i wear my white leg jeans i kind of wanted to wear these with like a white um tank top and then a cropped i've got like a cropped mo like brownie color blazer so yeah i thought that would look really really nice together and then with trainers so that was kind of my type of outfit vibe because i know we are having some great weather at the moment in the uk but how long that's going to be around for i do not know and also maybe for an airport outfit these might be quite nice because they are really really soft but they're still like lightweight so like yeah maybe these with like a crop top and a blazer for an airport outfit would look really really nice i do still need to plan my airport outfits um so yeah i grabbed those as well now that was everything that i picked up from asos i hope you guys really enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and i shall see you in the next one bye